doctors claim convertibles are bad for you because they're harmful for your hearing. And if you put your your roof down, the noise generator can reach 99 decibels. Right. So, which is not far off, according to this press release, um, something that happens. Now, that's noisy. Oh, that's so, easy. I don't know exactly what it is. It's going to be Concord taking off or something. No. A bomb going off? No. No. It's too much, isn't it? That deafens you. Uh, a motorcycle revving? No. Uh, I don't know. Road drilling? Oh, yeah. That's another cliche, isn't it? Okay. So surely, surely the worst, the worst sound in the in the world is road drilling, of course. Uh, but I cannot believe it says almost as much as not far off the 110 decibels generated by road drilling. I wonder what car they used. One of these, like a 50s Cadillac or something, and drove it without any wind buffeting. No, they've, cars... they've driven a car and they basically put somebody holding a road drill in the back. <laughs> to follow them around. <laughs> That's right, yeah. yeah. To act as some sort of sat nav. So what, so what do they advise? Doctors recommend winding up the windows. Oh, right, okay. Or wearing basic ear protection. Well, not many people will be able to drive at 50 to 70 miles an hour with all the windows down, will they? Yeah, you'll get serious hearing damage. Yeah. But then, you know, you might as well just go to a kind of ACDC gig, really. Yeah. I mean, it's a way, it's what, what kind of nanny state, what kind of nanny state is this? <laughs> I love this. This is the hard shoulder death risk for hire for men. So that basically, if you break down on a hard shoulder, if you're a bloke, yeah. you're more likely to die. How much more likely? That's a good question, isn't it? Uh, three times as likely. Right. That was a good question, wasn't well it? Yeah. Okay. I think I know exactly why that is the reason. Why is that going on? Okay, because when a guy breaks down in a car, the yes. first thing he thinks is, I'll see if I can fix, fix this. <laughs> and the That's first right. thing he does yeah. is he pulls scratches, the bonnet. Scratches his ass. Yeah. And then like, oh yeah, that, I can do that. He pulls the bonnet <laughs> and looks at the battery and hopes that one of the terminals has come off. <laughs> or he looks for a massive switch that's popped off or something. And Oh, yeah. it's horrible being it's a just, It's just so embarrassing. Torch out. Yeah, yeah, it's just, you know, it probably takes you 20 minutes to find out how you open the bonnet in the first place. <laughs>